Hi there, and welcome to Allendale Junior High. My name is Martin Fechner. I'm the principal here at Allendale, and I'm excited to share with you our virtual open house tonight. Please take time to peruse our site. Uh, in the site, you'll find a walkabout of the school with information in different areas of the school. Uh, in our site, you'll also find some uh, information about our programs. Uh, we also have at seven o'clock Google Meets that you can drop in and out of to uh, learn about our programs that we offer and meet some staff that are teaching those programs. So let's begin. So what makes Allendale unique? Well, number one, academic excellence. It's a standard here at the school. A variety of programs that we offer. Uh, we offer the full junior high experience, meaning that we are only dedicated to the 789 program, and we have an amazing staff. There's a high focus on academic excellence in all curricular areas. We have outstanding, motivated, and respectful students. Our students make the difference at Allendale. We offer at lunch an extensive intramural program, lunch and after school clubs and activities, we are a safe school. Uh, we are a friendly and highly educated staff. Our, uh, we offer homeroom activities promoting citizenship and character development. We offer competitive athletic teams that students can try out for at all levels. We have an exceptional student leadership opportunities available to students looking for that. We have access to technology to support learning in the classroom. We have a strong parent and community support. So, Four programs at Allendale, but one great school. Our first program that we offer at Allendale is the COVID program. Our next program is the German bilingual program. We then have our regular academic program and a, we are a division site for an interactions program, which is for students with autism. So let's talk about the COVID program. What is that? Well, it's a program where we offer extra challenges. We look for interesting extensions, faster pace with expectations regarding homework and regular studying. There's a high expectation for homework completion, achievement, and behavior in that classroom. Not for everyone, but students that are currently earning A's and B's in their classes find it a really good fit. The two extra courses that would be added to a student's timetable here would be world history at the grade 7, 8, 9 level and the mathematical geometry at the 7, 8, 9 level as well. German bilingual, we are the only junior high in Edmonton to offer German bilingual programming. We offer German bilingual at uh, the German language arts and in the German social studies. The remainder of the program is taken in English. Students in grade nine will challenge the Sprach Diplom A2 and B1. All German bilingual students continuing in the program are accepted. German bilingual is also continued after Allendale for those students wishing to continue at the Strathcona High School. Our regular academic program, students are held to a high standard for a level of behavior and achieving at their highest. Usually students who live within our attendance boundaries who do not want to attend, uh, who do not want the academic extensions associated with COVIDO. Our interactions program, we are a school division site for students with autism. Some students are integrated within our regular program. We encourage full participation in school events such as Eagle groups and other activities at lunch. So what's the advantage for Allendale? Well, what classes will you take? Let's start there. Well, anywhere, anywhere you go for junior high, you will take language arts, math, science, and social, phys ed, and health. We do offer some changes when it comes to second language opportunities. I'll talk to that later. Our fine arts program is quite stellar and our CTF quarter options, it allows for students to have access to numerous options throughout the year. So second language options, students will choose one language for the year. So if you're in German bilingual, it's obvious you'll be taking German. Uh, we can, as a German bilingual school, offer introductory German to students who do not want to continue with their French that they had from elementary, and they can take German 7, 8, 9 at the introductory level. We also offer the continuation, though, of the French from grade 6 to grade 7, 8, and 9. Fine arts. For students in grade 7, we have it set up as follows. We have an amazing band program, and as such, it is a full year program if you choose band. We also offer drama and art. Those are connected as half your courses. So if you choose art, you will be getting drama as well. And if you choose drama, you'll be choosing art as well for half the year. We offer numerous CTF quarter options. They are subject to change based on teachers and the courses that they're offering. Um, but lots of information we shared on our site tonight. So please ask those questions in those CTF Google Meets. Eagle groups, this is something that's important to me. Each student is a member of an Eagle group. This is like a health home room. Students will meet in their Eagle groups, take part in school-wide activities and challenges and events, such as Taste of Allendale, Terry Fox Run, team building, character education, and other assemblies. So, Eagles, 
What are we all about when it comes to athletics? Well, we offer a lot of things, cross country running teams, soccer teams at the girls and boys level, volleyball teams, juniors and seniors, girls and boys, basketball, uh, junior, senior, girls and boys, curling team, flag football team, badminton team, slow pitch, track and field, and the list goes on. Clubs and activities. Junior high is a great opportunity to get involved and try things that you've never had an opportunity to do, maybe. Uh, we encourage all our students to get involved in some kind of activity outside of the, the, the lunch hour. Uh, so some of the clubs that we have are invention convention, science fair, debate club, board game club, art club, competition, uh, completion center, sorry, school play, dream catchers club, uh, improv team and the movie club. So how do you get to Allendale? Well, seeing that we're in a mature neighborhood in Edmonton, uh, ETS is easy transport. LRT is not too far away from us as well. We have a lot of parents that love to drive. And of course, walking in our community is also a great opportunity. Parent involvement. We encourage our parents to get involved wherever and whenever they can. We have a strong school council and Allendale Education Foundation, our AEF, our ACES, our Alberta Cultural Exchange Experience Society, is currently on pause due to the COVID that has uh, run through um, our, our society in the last couple of years here. We're hoping that that can get started soon again. And we are also part of the AGBI, which is the Association for English and German Bilingual Education in Edmonton. So how do you enroll? Well, you're going to select your school in school zone. Each spring, parents across districts will pre-enroll by telling us the school they'd like their child to attend for next year. Pre-enrollment helps schools and families plan for next year. Between March 8th and April 14th, sign into your parent school zone account and select your child's preferred school. You do not need to pick courses at this time. We will take care of that in May. If you need help and can't connect to school zone to pre-enroll, or if you have questions about choosing a school, talk to your child's current school principal uh, for information on how to get that fixed up. So key points that you should be aware of. Parents may pre-enroll their child through school zone or complete registration form for students that are outside of EPSB at, on our website for more information. Uh, this must be done uh, in order to participate in the random selection process if we go to one. Schools must accept all students who pre-enroll um, or conduct a random selection if we're over our lottery number. So who's accepted during pre-enrollment? Well, all returning students are accepted. Students who reside in our attendance area are accepted. Students residing in the CODRA boundary uh, program are accepted. Students continuing in the German bilingual program are automatically accepted. Out of attendance area, students are accepted if space permits. Now, I will tell you this, that we have not gone to a random selection in my time here as principal. Um, so your chances of getting in at Allendale are really good. If there are more students though, from outside our attendance area that apply, than the space that is available, there will be a random selection um, that would happen. So all students applying to a school are considered equally. There's no first come, first serve. Uh, there are no waiting lists. If a program is deemed to be full after the pre-enrollment process, the waiting list of students cannot be kept in the event that space is available in September. The pre-enrollment process provides equal uh, access and fair access to schools and programs for all students in Edmonton Public. So, in uh, August, we'll send out information on school zone. You will, once you uh, become an Allendale student, there'll be a transition from your elementary uh, school zone account to the junior high school zone account at Allendale. There'll be information there regarding a grade seven orientation. Right now we're shooting for the day before school starts, which is August 31st at 10 a.m. We're hoping to have parents and students come on in to get you uh, acquainted with the school, get you to uh, get your lockers, your textbooks, and all those things set up. If you require more information, please don't hesitate to uh, check out our website. Uh, if you have questions, you can email myself, Martin Fetchner at epsb.ca or my assistant principal, Brenna Meriden at epsb.ca. And we'll be happy to answer any questions you may have. Tonight, we're offering drop-in sessions starting at seven o'clock. They're short sessions, so they're about 10 minutes each. Um, you'll be able to just jump in, talk to different departments, talk to different staff, and just learn about our school and what we offer. The cycle for tonight will happen as follows. We're gonna have a session at seven, then 7.10, then 7.20, 7.30, and so on, every 10 minutes until eight o'clock. Uh, each session will repeat itself. So in other words, if you want to get into the math session at seven, it would be the same presentation at 7.10 if that was what was happening there, okay? Um, but this provides you the opportunity to get into as many sessions as you want to get to know some of the programming here at Allendale School or ask questions that you may have. So with that, I thank you very much for uh, taking the time tonight to come to our virtual open house. Again, if you have any questions, please reach out. My name is Martin Fechner, the principal here at Allendale, uh, and welcome. Looking forward to meeting you all.